first task here is, I'm going to go quick. So welcome. Again, there's so many people here that are distinguished guests. We decided that I shouldn't try to name them all because we'll forget somebody and we don't want to make you mad. But lots of people from the DOE here, from local government, Argonne Lab leadership. There's also the scientists at Argonne that participate in the program. Uh, a big welcome to all of you. Thanks so much for coming. I just want to give also a special nod to the ecosystem partners that are here. Uh, not just the advisory council that earlier this afternoon where we had a really hard substantive discussion about the program and where it needs to go in the future but also all of you here tonight that serve as mentors advisors best friends investors industry contacts uh, to our program uh, i've heard all my life all the the time that i've spent as an entrepreneur that is last 20 25 years hearing about how special chicago is and it just gets more and more special all the time. Every day I run this program, I discover another contact, another resource that I consider essential to what we're trying to do in the program. So thank you so much. Quickly, how CRI works. It's important to know that we're not your typical startup incubator accelerator. In fact, we don't use the word startup. We use fellow innovator as our kind of starting point. We're looking for people that have made a discovery in the lab. They can be young, they can be old, they can be working in industry, they can be working at a university setting, and they've been bitten by a passion. And that passion is to see that innovation in a product that's actually making a difference in the real world. We don't have programs like that, and this is one of the three programs it's the lab and bit entrepreneurship program that selects in a very, very competitive process the few, few people who've got this passion and can drive something to market. It's very high touch. It's very intense. But one of the other things we do is we look into the national labs and we say to ourselves, what people and equipment and resources that these young people and old people and all walks of life people, what can they use to drive their technology faster, quicker, cheaper to market. This is energy hard tech, this is not software. Energy hard tech takes a long time. Can the labs accelerate it? It's not just about the toys, it's about the people, the scientists at the lab who've worked in these tech areas their whole lives that can help these uh, innovators do what they're trying to do. We give them a million dollars for two years. So this is not a pitch competition, it's not just 10K and good luck. It's a very intense program with a lot of pressure on it. We're trying to go from science to science reality in just a couple of years in the energy hard tech space. It's crazy hard. And again, the ecosystem is important. It's lab embedded entrepreneurship program, but it's also the ecosystem. Here in Chicago, it's vibrant, and our other programs just as vibrant as well. We're trying to build successful businesses. So at the end of the day, we're trying to enable these, these innovators to build something that gets product in the market. That's our focus. We're very, very fortunate tonight not just to be talking about Argonne and Chain Reaction Innovations. We are highlighting all three of the lab embedded entrepreneurship programs that are sponsored uh, by the Department of Energy as well as other sponsors outside the uh, uh, Department of Energy. Uh, my good friend Dan Miller from Innovation Crossroads is here with four of his innovators who are going to present tonight. Also, Tom Busey is here from Cyclotron Road, the program at Lawrence Berkeley National Lab. They have a couple of their teams uh, they are going to present tonight as well. It's a really special occasion in part because this is the first time all three LEAP programs are highlighted together uh, in an event such as this. And without further ado, I said it was going to be short. That was reasonably short. Let's get this started. All right. Come on. Let's hear it. Let's go.